What is going on guys? This is Mystic Spade or Aaron here with CovenantMods.com showing off the 20 mode controller that we offer to the public. They start off at $70 which uh, even is still a better option than you will get buying it from anywhere else so definitely stop by the site check it out. But right now we're going to start off with uh, mode 1 which is uh, fully auto with three settings of slow, medium, and fast. And right now we're actually going to start off with the slow setting here. And that's slow. That's the slow setting. Let it reload. And then this is going to be the medium right here. That's the medium setting. Go ahead and let empty that clip out. And then this is going to be the fast setting. Okay. With the P99. And I'm using the P99 pistol because it's probably the most effective pistol that you start off with that you can actually make good use out of this with and as you can see the recoil gets pretty high up there on the fast setting and then it also works with the RSAS rifle and then we're back to we're back to slow here this is slow and then this is gonna be medium and we're out of ammo and we're gonna assassinate myself here and it's never called suicide you wanna call it assassinate yourself And then this is going to be f the fast setting. That is the fast setting with the RSAS. And as you can see, that grouping is ridiculous. Okay, and we'll just come side by side and do it from the hip. And as you can see, it's not pretty drastic. And once again, this is P99 on fast. And as you can see, that recoil kind of climbs. Now here's what we're going to do. I'm going to switch this to the Akimbo to the akimbo mode, the akimbo settings. And we have two different versions for akimbo. We have dual trigger mode, which is where you just hold down the triggers, both of them, or there is an akimbo mode, which you actually just hold down one trigger and it fires both. And then right now, let me go ahead and make sure I have it in the right mode here. This is mode one, which is slow. This is the slow one. And this is gonna be the fast mode right here for the single trigger akimbos. And as you can see the recoil is pretty high. And then there's a user programmable, which is this one. And then this is burst. We have a burst mode right here. And burst kind of works out very well for the akimbos. And then we have jitter mode, which unfortunately jitter mode, as you can see, does not work in Modern Warfare 3. <laughs> they patched it in Modern Warfare 3 it still works in Modern Warfare 2, just not, it works in Black Ops, uh, World at War, Call of Duty 4, etc., just not in Modern Warfare 3, they patched it. And then we have Burst Mode, and then we'll just go ahead and, that's, that's three round burst, and then this is going to be four, four round burst. And then that's just that's just two round bursts right there, you know. So and then the burst modes they all have different modes within modes. And then mode five is the dual trigger mode. And then I'll sh show you that right now. Let's go ahead and change it. Okay. And then what this is, you just hold down one trigger for one gun, and then the other for the other gun. Real simple. That's all you gotta do. It's not synced up, it's not synchronization or anything like that. You just, it's whatever you're holding down. And then mode 6 has two modes within it, but it is for Call of Duty. It is for Call of Duty World at War. That's all it really works for. You know, because the patch is on it and everything. And it's not very usable here. But then that is all the modes. And then we do have one also right here. And this is gonna be called the Auto Drop Shot. Okay, this is auto drop shot mode, and what it does, it aims down sights and everything for you. You just hold down the right trigger and let the bullets fly. That's all you got to do. Auto drop shot, it only works on default control settings. That is it, you know, and if you're aiming down sights, when you start, when you start shooting, it's not going to lay down, so you're still good. But if, say if you come around the corner and you just hold down the trigger, bam, that's all you got to do. And this was spade. 
with covenantmods.com showing you what our controller does its certain functions certain features and if you would like a slightly more detailed video please leave a note in the description let me know and uh, definitely please stop by our website check out our prices check out our customization options later